In today's video, I wanna to talk to you about how a covering is a form of liability insurance. Let's talk about it. Yah Shalom. Thank you for tuning in to another Righteous Spiritful episode. Today I'm back at it in them trenches handling that kingdom business. Man, when you think about driving and operating a vehicle, you know, in the United States, you have to have uh, at minimum liability insurance to be able to cover you in the event of an accident. And if you do not have liability insurance, say for instance, you get in your car and cause $40,000, $50,000 worth of damage, uh, you know, $15,000 to a side rail, you have to pay for that in full and a lawsuit can be taken out against you because you do not have a covering. You do not have coverage. That's what they call it, uh, insurance coverage, liability coverage, okay? So for those that are new to truth, I'm, I'm breaking it down uh, purple suit and yellow toenails, Barney style, so you can understand it. And as believers, as we're on this walk, we wanna ensure that we meet the circumstances, the parameters, the boundaries, the rules, the precepts, the commandments, the laws, the statues of our covering. And the word of the Most High Yah says, obey them that have rule over you for they keep watch for your souls. So when you think about that, when he gives us biblical order, Hamashiach is the head of man, man is the head of woman, the Most High Yahoo is the head of Hamashiach. You know, Yahshua came to fulfill the will of the Most High Yah. So he came to fill the very instructions that the Most High Yah had already set forth through the means that he used. He didn't come to do anything different. You know, and this is why he is our covering uh, as men. And what good is you having liability insurance if you know the policy says that you can't drink and drive, you can't uh, ride in your car and smoke dope and be drugged out of your mind. You know, uh, you must uh, have your seatbelt on, all of this stuff. Because what you find out is, when you violate the terms of the policy, you don't have no coverage. That coverage is null and void. You know, they said, you know what? We cannot honor this because you didn't meet the terms of it. And it's the same thing. We got a lot of women out here that won't, won't husbands, won't good God-fearing men, but I want you to understand, the Most High Yah would have it that you are blameless. See, if you abide by the terms, of the, the liability policy, his law, statutes, precepts, and commandments, he can find you blameless. No, it was no fault of your own because you were in right standing. And it's the, th it's the same thing, sisters out here. You know, don't call yourself wanting a husband, wanting a covering, you know, wanting a good man of Yah because you are supposed to worship him like he is Messiah. Because if that man is submitted to the Most High Yah and he is setting forth righteous terms and boundaries and precepts and ordinances for you to follow and you choose not to do it, don't be surprised if you don't have any coverage. Because a lot, a lot of men and women are gonna find out that they thought they had liability insurance that they were blameless, but because you chose to go off and do something that was contrary to what the instructions or the precepts or the commandments, the laws and statutes actually said, man, your, your, your insurance policy is null and void. Close to the Yacht Ministries kicking that thing, gun barrel straight. Wow. 